In this video, I'm going to show you how to sew a skirt with a handkerchief hem. For this project, you're going to need thread, pins, measuring tape, scissors, elastic, you can go with something thin or something a little thicker, and some fabric. The fabric that you choose should be something that's quite lightweight. The piece of fabric that I'm starting out with is a meter and a half by two meters, and I'm going to fold that in half. And then I'm going to cut that piece into two rectangles. And then I'm going to hem all four sides of each of those two pieces. With thin fabrics like this, I like to fold it over once and tuck the fabric into the presser foot and do a zigzag stitch. I find this is an easy way to hem lightweight fabrics without creating too much bulk. Sometimes it's hard to sew right at the edge of the fabric, so I'll go over and re-sew those edges again. If you have some fraying fabric that's poking through that you don't like, you can also redo that zigzag stitch a second time. Now you're going to take your large hip measurement, which is just the largest part of your waist. Now we're going to take the rectangle that we just cut, fold it in half, and find its center. Then we're going to cut a slit that's going to be one quarter of our large hip measurement. And this is creating the opening of our skirt. Now we're going to do the exact same with our second rectangle piece. And then we're going to take these two pieces and place them on top of each other. We're now going to pin these two layers together. Because the hem changes in length, you may want to disperse the longer points evenly throughout the skirt, but it's totally up to you. I took my time while I was pinning this part, moving the pieces around, trying it on until I created something that I liked. I even decided to pin up some of the corners so that the hem wasn't as long and it created a little more gathering. You also want to make sure that both of your pieces are facing in the same direction so that's either right sides up or wrong sides up, it doesn't really matter. We're now going to measure out our elastic, so placing it where you want the skirt to sit, either on your mannequin or on yourself, making sure you're leaving a 2 centimeter overlap. Then using a zigzag stitch, we're going to attach these two ends of the elastic. Go back and forth a few times so it's nice and secure. The next step is to attach the elastic to the skirt. So here I'm placing the elastic on the wrong side of the skirt and then we're going to sew around with a zigzag stitch. I flipped it around for when I was sewing, but this is me sewing on the right side of the skirt with the elastic underneath. Make sure that you're tugging the elastic slightly as you sew so it fits around the full skirt. I did two stitches, but you can do as many as you like. So we're then going to flip the elastic over, and again we're looking at the right side of the skirt, and we're going to pin it down to the under layer. This is going to keep the elastic in place, but you won't see it because of the top layer covering it. And then we're going to go along where we pinned with another zigzag stitch. So again, this stitch is on the right side of the fabric, and it's going to be on the second layer of the skirt, covered by the top layer of the skirt. The final touch is I'm going to hand stitch a little bow onto the front of my skirt, and you're all done! Thank you so much for watching and if you liked this video, please subscribe.